Hey everybody, Ann here sitting in front of the chicken yards having my coffee. Well, I had to make a change in the flocks last night. See this girl? Yep, mama. I have put her in the pan with the barred rocks and the barred rock rooster and the two other baby chicks. Because, well, a couple things. Um, see how her tail is kind of like black? <laughs> The leghorn's tail sticks up really super far and she gets on, up underneath the van and it drags on the bottom of the van which is very dirty probably has some oil in it on it here and there that and the other chickens had started picking on her pretty bad and pulling some feathers and stuff so she's in here so this one this pen is going to be barred rocks and leghorns and then BBL. Uh, last night, when they had all gone up to roost, I went ahead and grabbed her um, and just put her in. And it seems like she's doing okay. She's a little confused. She sees her other flock mates, hears them, and she's trying to get to them. Uh, oh, but I think she's going to fare better in this pen because she is the only white chicken. And the other chickens just went after her so she's gonna get a few more leghorns there's one other leghorn mix in here and so it's gonna be well rocky three uh jane and, and jenny mama bbl um dotty the other leghorn and the three leghorns granted if they're all uh <laughs> it's okay mama you'll get used to it if they're all hens, I'll put them back in here too. And I am eventually going to add Roxy back in here. I don't know if I'll do that tonight, but um, I just needed to get her out. Maybe she'll become a full white leghorn again someday soon. But I just didn't want like seeing her getting picked on so bad. Hello, Mama. So I want to take good care of her. And hopefully she'll get her tail feathers back and she'll become white again anyhow uh today not sure what i gotta do i i gotta take papa for his long walk here and i'll take you along so you can see what we see and um i don't know i didn't get the carrots planted yesterday so i think i'm gonna do that today and just see what else the day brings look at you can see me while i'm filming and see papa too <laughs> it's a little feature on my camera, so it's kind of hard to hold the camera and walk at the same time. Come on, Papa, let's, you know the route. Let's go. <laughs> He's such a good boy. He loves going for his walk. How you doing, Mama? Oh, girlfriend, I know, I know. You feel like you're not in the right place, but you are. You'll get used to it. I want you to get your lovely feathers back. <laughs> All right, Peppa, let's go. <laughs> Holy Mary, mother of, oh my gosh. Look at this, look at this, you guys. Come on, Papa, it's okay, it's okay, boy. <laughs> look at, he doesn't want to come back in here. Does he know something I don't? Come on, Papa, look at. Oyster mushrooms, that one down there is not an oyster mushroom. Let me get closer to it. It is, it's like a fly agaric, but it's a yellow one. So yeah, that's definitely not edible. But these are, they're veiled oyster mushrooms. So you know, after I'm done with my walk, I'm going to harvest these. Look at, I'm not even in a frame. I don't like this. <laughs> uh, and I'm going to fry me up some fried oyster mushrooms oh they're gonna be so good oh I forgot to tell you okay so when I switched my phone over um, and reloaded the apps for my mail app um, I forgot my password and so the only way to reset it is you have to agree that well any of the encrypted stuff because I use a highly encrypted um, email app uh, you lose access to all of your encrypted emails which means anything that anybody sent me recently, I can't read it. <laughs> it's just all gobbledygook. So if you emailed me recently and I haven't gotten back to you, and I know there's several people, um, 
email me again uh, with the same thing because I, I don't know any other way to do it. I know, I think um, Megan had sent me something. Um, I think somebody named Deborah. I think Deborah sent me something, um, uh, something about seeds. Um, I think Donna had sent me something and then there were a whole bunch of people trying to get me to do unboxing videos, but you know what? I mean, I could have so much free stuff, but oh, there's a bug on me. Yikes. Um, but I see absolutely no reason to ask them to send me stuff that I can't really use. Uh, so yeah, any of you who have re recently emailed me, please email me again with the subject matter that you wanted to talk to me about because I can't read your emails anymore. Anyhow, yeah, still got Papa with me. What do you think, boy? What do you think of this? Um, and I'm still looking for mushrooms all over the place. There's a ton of them, but they're not edible. What you doing? What you doing? The other day, I was walking on Mr. Lucas' path. He saw a deer, and he about rip my arm off trying to get to it so yeah that kind of tells me he loves to hunt for critters so I can't let him run loose the good thing is about keeping him confined is I have seen a lot of wild rabbits roaming around a ton of wild rabbits I did get the carrots planted I planted a few rows in here with these green peppers and I planted a cheap dollar store carrots in there and then I planted some more expensive <laughs> carrots in there not as thick because um, I was running out of seeds so and um, I put the rest of the worm bin in there I'm not raising worms anymore uh, so the worm castings in the soil is in there and it's just really rich and lush look at my breakfast you guys the top four is uh, the largest of the baled oyster mushroom and all the rest are fried green tomatoes. It may look a little bit dark to you, but I put some uh, curry powder, some turm well, it's got turmeric in it, some chili powder. So I'm just going to give this a try. Oh my gosh. I haven't had fried oyster mushrooms for so long. Mmm. Mmm. Mmm, mmm, mmm. Oh, I did a good job this time. Look. It's like chicken, doesn't it? Look it! Look it, I'm all dirty! <laughs> I've been digging in the dirt. Mmm. Mmm. I need a so good. Let me wipe. Oh, that was gross. I need a bath. Let me try one of these fried green tomatoes. Okay? Look at me. I'm sweating. Mmm. Yum. Mmm. Mmm. <laughs> it came out. <laughs> that's okay it still tastes good it's going to the same place anyhow I gotta tell you guys this delicious stuff makes my year fried oyster mushrooms fried green tomatoes mm. and I got the real the batter really well this time and uh, well I dip it in like a uh, jiffy mix mixture with a bunch of seasonings in them and then I take them out and then I put an egg, and I do it all in like a, uh, a plastic baggie. And then I crack an egg into the <coughs> Jiffy Mix. Good morning, Earl Will. Um, I put a little water in, maybe milk if I have it. Mix it all up in the bag. Throw everything back in, well, one at a time. And get it real nice and coated. Mm. I do believe it's going to rain. Which would be great because I just planted all those carrots. Anyhow, you just fry it up. Oh, you know what? This is going to be a great day. It doesn't matter what is going to happen. It's still going to be a good day. It is. Just because I found that oyster mushroom. Mm, fried up some green tomatoes. Got some, uh, what do you call it? Carrots planted. Uh, the day is young. I, I need to go to the store later. Mmm. Oh, Fried green tomato. Yeah. 
I think I better take a bath or a shower before I go, don't you? <laughs> and it's raining. My garden is getting water. The frog pond is filling up. I'm filling up buckets and catchment thingies. Woohoo! So I'm just gonna sit out here and enjoy this rain. And until it starts getting really super bad, um, it's not blowing right now, but oh, I just love it, I love it. I'm getting water, my plants are getting watered, and it's cool, so you can't beat that. It stopped raining and it kind of seems like the sun is gonna come out again. And I noticed that poor mama, she's just pacing. She, she kind of looked like she wanted to lay an egg. So I picked her up, put her in the coop, shut it, gave her her own food and water. And she went into the little nesting box in there and started throwing stuff over her back. So I don't know, maybe she's gonna lay an egg for me today. Sometimes if chickens are moved or they go through a stressful event, she's been through both, they won't lay for a little while. I don't know. Um, so I, I think I'm just going to go ahead and end this video here and uh, then I can upload it while I'm in town. It'll be quicker. And um, well, that's all I got for you guys today. See you in the next video. Thanks for watching everybody. I hope you enjoyed the video. Make sure you like, subscribe, hit the bell, and y'all have a good one.